Roy's name is Martin. Um, I've been invited up the St Paul's Cathedral by the head conservator, Mr John Herrier. He's created a project called Hidden Hands uh, to coincide with the tercentenary of the great master carver, Mr William Gibbons. Uh, I've studied and followed Mr Gibbons' work ever since I was a 15-year-old apprentice. And for the past 35 years, I've worked on many English and Scottish heritage projects as well as restoring many listed buildings all across the UK. Um, when discussing the carved elements to the architects and the designers, there's always one name that comes into the conversation. When talking about the carved details, uh, Mr. Grindon Gibbons, his work has never been surpassed. Um, not only is this man's exquisite work plain to see, when you do view it, you've got to realise that it's over 300 years old. Um, he lived in a time in our history, in our past, way before even electricity was discovered, so there was no use of any hand power tools, any CNC machines, and especially no computer aid to guide the artwork. Everything you see this man has produced is hand drawn, hand cut, and hand carved. And for over 300 years, this man's work has been admired by millions, and many have tried to copy it. Um, some in small doses, I presume, have to equal it, but to me, it's never been surpassed. The man remains to this day, to me, an absolute genius.